let's talk a little bit about remove hidden stitches. Remove hidden stitches is a feature of Essentials. Now here I have an embroidery design which I used creating Stitch Artist and an existing stitch file. The existing stitch file here was the, the green outline that you see. This is supposed to be an applique um, with applique stops to, to mark the fabric and tack it down. And then I placed the, the design for the interior of the mask and then we do the, the border to finish up the top and bottom of the mask. So um, I made this design in my software and then I took it to my embroidery machine and I discovered this. No stitches in the border, none at all. Um, so there's no, no tack down and there's no applique mark. There's no stitches here. I think there maybe were three stitches is what we're seeing here. One here, one here, and one there. That's not what I wanted. The way this design goes together, I needed those stitches. So can you guess what happened? Gold star if you did. Okay, so what I did at the machine actually was just because I know my design so well, I went forward to do the next spot in the design where there is an, an outline and a, a tack down for that. And I used those rather than go back to my software and fix my design. But how could I have avoided this? Well, um, and Brilliance does have the ability with Essentials to remove hidden stitches, but it gives you control. So you can make it not do that if you want to. So here's what I needed to do. Here's my design before saving. What I need to do is go into my preferences and under files, uncheck these two boxes. One says remove overlaps when saving stitch files. The other says treat objects labeled act applique position is filled. Okay, so I'm just uncheck both of those and apply that before I save my stitch file. And then I have my outline, my mark, and my tack down for the applique. And then the design works the, the way I want it to. A tip on using remove hidden stitches with applique and stitch artists together and in brilliance.